Good evening, everybody. It is still Monday. I didn't think, out, like usual, you know, you never think you're going to make any more videos, but I wanted to get on tonight. I got some happy mail, birthday, Valentine's, I think, in the mail today, so I wanted to get on and show that um, and just um, say a few other things. Um, um, Sandra Carlin is my secret Santa. Um, and I announced earlier, I mentioned that I sent Marlene's um, package out today, and I just got an email. Um, I haven't read it all. I just, before I got on here, I just kind of got the gist of it. Um, I'll let you guys all know later. Um, but Marlene, you're going to get a, another blessing. Um, Sandra says she had mentioned this before, um, but she wants to send you, I have to give her your name and address. Um, I have to email it to her. I have to check and see if she left her email. Actually, I think I might have her email because she did my um, the swap I did last year where we, you know, we did, um, I think it was like three envelopes a week or four or something like that, you know, with little stickers and stuff and we traded. So that's, you know, um, so I think I, well, either way, I'll make sure I have her email, but she wants me to send her your address so that she can send you a little package to, you know, to the winner. Um, too so look forward to that um and as you can see my bed's a mess i'm trying to you know i've had bags over here and stuff i'm trying to sort through things because there was some other stuff i wanted to send Mar marlene that i got recently i had some um um oh my god you guys know i can never think some um what in the world um presses or whatever oh, i can't even think you know embossing folders and you know from michael's and stuff like that you know so i'll probably do another little package later um you know i couldn't find it so i'm trying to like sort through everything um you guys know i used to have a, like a craft room and then my in room you know i my friend was looking for a place i'm like maybe i'm looking for a roommate you know i was kind of like uh you know <laughs> then he didn't move in so i mean i never had all these bookcases back here so i have two bookcases you know they're kind of filled you know, with papers and stickers and whatever. Um, I'm not sure if I can show you because because this is my computer, but I have like three um, three um, tables, you know, folding tables over here filled with stickers and you know my Gemini, you know, and stuff. So I don't know if I can actually show you guys over there, but it's kind of like you know, this is my bedroom slash craft room. Sorry. Just trying to see if I can, I'm not sure how long this cord is, but just so you guys can see when I'm, you know, so I'm trying to, you know, because it's hard to craft when you can't find anything. Yeah, if you can see the tables over there. This is a big room. It's probably, a, I don't know, 15 by 20 feet, I think. So it's not, you know, yeah, if you can see over there a little bit of it, you know, the table, so... You know, there's a lot of room in here, but, you know, you don't really, <laughs> but, you know, I like to craft and stuff, so. And I have another folding table I can unfold, um, because, sorry, I keep popping that thing open, because technically, oh, <laughs> I keep hitting the eject button, because technically, um, I was supposed to keep one table cleared over there, but then I kept getting more stickers and, you know, more goodies from you guys and more stuff, you know, I would get on clearance and whatever, so you know how it is and so yeah i'm trying to go through the stuff i've bought and i bought a lot of new die cuts and stuff like that so i'm trying to go through that and get it situated and get um my um sorry keep messing with this now getting my um you know, I get a lot of friend mail. I find stuff on clearance. I find stuff I think people will like. I whatever. So I try to keep it in, trying to keep it in contained in one box. And I have a lot of stuff I bought for friend mail. Like I bought die cuts and I bought other stuff that I meant to, you know, that was going to go in the prize package and stuff like that that I, you know, like couldn't find and I wanted to get it out and you know and stuff. So I need to put it, you know, more so in the boxes, you know, that I have. Um, but anyway. <laughs> So I'm rambling. I forgot what I was, you know, even going. But um, I wanted to show you guys some jewelry, too. I picked this up at work. I forgot I had it um, probably a month ago or something. And I just put it in this box. You know, we got them at the dollar store. I love these boxes. You know, it's got the cherries on top. 
Um, I picked up this jewelry. Um, a lot of people bring in, they'll bring in, like, you know, I work in the medical field, I'm a nurse's aide in a nursing home. Um, people bring in, like, you, you know, old scrubs they've outgrown, or they just, you know, they've, um, you know, a lot of it's, you know, the girls or whatever, and, um, uh, you know, other stuff, you know, people bring in books, whatever, you know, and in our break room, and, you know, the, you know, for free, whatever, and stuff, and, um, somewhat new brought in and we get a lot of donations for the residents and sometimes you know people can't use it uh for the residents like they'll bring in you know like some of this jewelry and stuff and you know either you know it's a choking hazard for them or it's just too big or no one wants it or we get an abundance of um scarves and hats and stuff like that that you, people are homemade and they're beautiful but there's just so many of it you know like people are really good about donating and stuff but then there's so much of it that, that you know and they let us go through but anyways there's some pretty pieces in here and then there's some kind of like i think yeah you know i mean it's not for any any of it's for me to wear so i figured maybe with you guys um to like put in a friend mail or some of it like i said i think it's kind of like Ew, you know um and i know some of you do uh, what is that art called well actually you can use it for your dangles for your um your travel of the journals, you know, I'll you take them apart, but you do that. What is that art where you do the layers and all that? I can't think of it. It's like, you know, we all kind of do things like that, but I know there's terms for these, but this is actually um, kind of pretty. So I thought like that some of you liked it because I know like Kathy Ludi, you know, she in her picture, she always looks, looks beautiful. You know, she always has her jewelry on and stuff like that. So I thought maybe, you know, her and some of the others, you know, if you like something like Kathy can let me know if she likes any of these pieces or you know the duchess or you know stuff like that so i think this one's really pretty it's kind of like a you know i don't think any of these are real of course but you know it has that pearl look and then like other stones and stuff i think this one's pretty myself personally doesn't mean you do but you know They bag these all individually, which I thought was nice. I think this one's kind of pretty. This is, you know, something I don't know if a girl would wear it today, but I always, you know, I kind of think of it. I like these dangles or whatever you call them, you know, like the, you know, I don't know. I just think they look classic, but, you know, I, obviously, you know, this looks like costume jewelry, but, you know, it's just something like, you know, just reminds me like from the 50s or something like with a prom dress. So, like I said, you could take these apart and use those for dangles or, you know, whatever you call them whatever you want to, you know, so I, there's that one. I know this one's gaudy, but, you know, guys know me. I like the color, you know, so I think it's just, I just think it's kind of pretty. I know it's kind of big. Maybe it's gaudy for some people, but I just, I just find it kind of pretty. Um, I think there might be, I'm not sure. I don't remember if they're all necklaces in here or if there's some bracelets, too. Yeah, I think this is the one. Is this the one? I'm not sure if this is the one I think is ugly. Not ugly, but... Yeah, it's not too bad, but... I I'm, you guys know me. I'm just not really into the metal kind of, you know, so it's kind of pretty. I mean, the, you know, I could see, you know, people, you know, that just like the metal or on a nice suit or something. So it's just, you know, guys know me. I like color and stuff. I'd be like one of those Jackie O's with the pearls and the button earrings, you know. <laughs> uh, then there's this one here. Just the classic, what, teardrop? Te tear, yeah, tear, teardrop. I can't even talk. With a long chain. I mean, you could take the chain off and, you know, so. It's actually quite a few in here. I forgot how many were in here. This is a smaller one. Oh, that's pretty. That is very pretty. It's got a a long chain, well, longish, um, like a, what do they call them, like a rope chain, thin chain, whatever you call it, like a thin chain. It's got, like, little diamonds. 
um, with a little, um, that is a, um, what do you call it? Hummingbird. I mean, these could be, you know, could be real silver for a while. I know it's not like, you know, the activities department gets this stuff, you know, and they go through it. It's not like they go and, you know, <laughs> use a little, you know, thing to see if it's real or not. But, um, I think this one's a bracelet. Oh, this is pretty if you like animal print. Usually I'm not really into animal print, but I love the yellow or the or you know, yellowish orange. I think it just, you know, goes over, so. Then there's Oh, these are pretty bracelets. These are more modern. My mom doesn't really wear jewelry, but these actually might be something she would like. I'm not sure. She wears like her wedding rings and she'll wear rings, but she's not really a big jewelry person. So that's why I didn't really, you know. Sometimes she does, but oh, this is pretty. Kind of that um, southwestern kind of thing. I know this is taking a while. I just put. It Oh, I think I'll, I forgot this is in there. I think I'll be keeping this for myself. It's just a little pin. You guys know I collect pins. I think I'll put that to the side. <laughs> There's one with beads and that'd be pretty for the fall with a, with a sweater or a turtleneck. one looks tiny. I don't know if it's a little bracelet or... I don't know. It's just a little dainty necklace with like... They almost look like real pearls. It actually might be real pearls. You know, they had those like sea pearls where they're not perfect. So these might be real pearls. I mean, if you have a little... You might actually might be able to look on there. That says NR on the little clasp. I'm not sure what NR is. Not real. I don't know. <laughs> the company name. They might be real. Like I said, it's not like activities and stuff knows, you know. You know, they're not going to stand there. And, and we have one more. Oh, actually, there's two in here. These come with those, uh, oh, that's pretty. It's got like a little heart for the, um, what do they call these? The, with the little, you know, where you put it through. I can't remember the name. Not lobster clap. No, that's not a, um, I forget the name of what they call that. But it's two different necklaces. Okay. Anywho, that's those. And now I will show you my friend mail. So I can get this video done and I can get that stuff done because here it's almost 5 o'clock already and back to work tomorrow. I did get from Miss Deb Hawk. I did get her, um, she sent me the, she's a stamping up re representative. Um, I did get the magazines today, or not the magazines, well, catalogs, magazines. To me, the catalogs are magazines, and I look at them like that, like, you know, you mark what you like and stuff, and um, I don't know if any of you else are like that, but to me, that's, <laughs> I don't know, it sounds weird, but, you know, I look at a catalog like I do a magazine, like, oh, you know, whatever. 
Um, this first one, as we know now, is for my secret birthday Santa, Christmas Santa. Sandra and Carlin, sorry. Um, oh, these cards she makes. I don't know how she has the... Oh, there's stuff in the back. I don't know how she has the time. I really need to buy some of these cellophane bags. <gasps> I have these vintage looking stickers that I was going to toss. Oh my god, what is wrong with her? <laughs> then I remember you love vintage. Hope you can use. If not, pass them on. <laughs> Oh my, are you crazy? You don't toss. Oh my God, I can't imagine. I almost had a heart attack when I saw that. <laughs> oh, she sent me a beautiful yellow bookmark. Oh, oh my God, I love these. Look at the little bricks. But I love the little wash basin with the little um, pitcher. I don't know where he got these, the little ornaments. Oh, I love these. Why would you toss these? Oh my God. There's two of those. Some roses. More of the roses. Oh, I love the bows and the Oh, wow, look at the... Oh! I love those, but look at this one. Wow. Oh, it's double-sided! Well she, well, she folded over, but... Gifted stickers. 1997. That's the year I graduated high school. Gifted stickers. I'll have to look that up online and see if they still sell these or if the company's still in business. Or Look at those. Thank you so much. Oh, throw them away. Oh, I hope toss means donate or something and not, you know, throwing them in the trash. Oh. <laughs> Drama queen. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, my God. My hands are shaking. Just from that word toss, I know. Now let's see the beautiful card. Wow. Oop. Happy birthday week. <laughs> Just a little something to brighten your day. I hope you're embracing your birthday week and agree with me that everyone should have a birthday week. It has been so fun being your secret Santa. I wonder if I will be, if I will still be secret <laughs> by the time you get this. Regards, SC. She used paper pattern. She wrote a little note here. Um, P.S. I forgot to tell you the reason I sent you this card was because it was a great example of how to use pattern paper for a quick and easy card. I personally think it's quite cute. I think all her card. All her cards are quite cute. Oh my god, sorry. Can't even. I need to find like a big. Um, I should look at Hobby Lobby. A big like poster size um, picture frame. I wonder if they have one like, you know, because these are what, 5x6 or no, 4x6, 4x5, something like that, whatever they are. And, you know, that would be cool to have, like, all these beautiful cards that she's made, like, in, you know, that I can't, I couldn't afford to have it made. Oh, my God, could you imagine what that would cost? <laughs> but if you could buy one like that, already made, and, you know, have it like that, with all these beautiful cards she's made, I'm going to check into that. If you did that homemade at, Mc, or homemade, I was going to say at McDonald's, <laughs> at Hobby Lobby or something, oh, my God. 
She sent me some beautiful stamps. I love this one. Happy, love, laugh, live, love. Oh. Laugh and be happy. Oh, wait a minute. It goes this way. Love, laugh, live, love, laugh, and be happy. I love that. Thank you, ma'am. She sent me this cute little rabbit. Of course, Easter's coming up. With the little trim. Look at that face. I love that. Um, she, David, I bought these and ended up really rare, oh, rarely using them. So I thought you might be able to use them. If not, friend them on. See, I'm the same way. If I send someone something, you know, like I said, I get a lot of stuff on clearance, you know, at Michael's or, you know, Hobby Lobby or whatever, when we find the clearance sales and, you know, other places and it's, you know, or the Dollar Tree. And if I think someone's really going to like it and if they don't, it's like, you know, that's what friend mail is for and stuff. It's like in this little community we have, it's like, you know, gifted on. Someone else can use it, you know, with their stickers. And, you know, she knows I like vintage and not everybody loves vintage. They like, you know, the steampunk, which, you know, it's like some of it's beautiful and some of it I'm kind of like, you know, it's just too hard. You guys know me. It's like if I was a girl, I'd be so girly. Well, I mean, not that I'm not, but, you know. <laughs> oh, these are so cute. Oh, my. I, I always keep saying I need to get my eyes checked and I never do. I'm like, you know. <laughs> Am I holding it backwards? Oh, well, that's probably why. There's something I'd like to thank you for. Oh, that's cute. You are my, is going to be all right, everything, celebrate, happy birthday, happy place. I don't know where she finds these. She always finds one with, finds ones with saying for like everything. It's not just happy birthday or happy anniversary. It's like little, you know, like for, you can use them for any occasion. Thank you so much. And then she sent me a little bag of ephemera. Someone else has sent me these before. Not these ones, but like things like this. And I love them. I don't know where you get them from. Oh, and I love the sticker. If anybody can tell me. Well, I'm sure Sandra can. <laughs> I love, I just love the, oh, I'm, oh, I'm ripping the sticker. I love.